Welcome back to Club Fitness. Uh, we're going to start this workout with a little bit of yoga. First thing we're going to do is cat curls. When you got our hands and knees, I want your knees to be straight up and down here with your uh, hips. I want them lined up here. And when you come down, have the hands right below the shoulders here. So first thing we're going to do here is we lift our head, our hips go down, I mean our, our uh, stomach goes down, and we lift our tush in the air. So from here, breathe in, head comes up. Breathe out, drop the head and lift your back up. So again, breathe in, lift up, breathe out, go down. So we're going to go for 10 of these. So we're going to count, breathe in, we're going to hold it, breathe out. That's one. So we're going to go up and down. All right, so here we go. Breathe in, one. Exhale. Two. Exhale. Three. Breathe in. Exhale. This is good for your back. Four. Breathe in. Exhale. Five. Breathe in. Exhale. Go for six. Exhale. Seven. Breathe in. Exhale. Hold it. Eight. Breathe in. Exhale. You see, I'm slowing it down this time. It's actually in yoga, you do it slow too, but I'm doing it a little bit quicker. Here we go. Nine. Exhale. Ten. Breathe in. Exhale. Good. All right, so the next thing we're going to do is called the upward dog. So we're going to lay down here, feet flat on the floor like this, hands on the side of the shoulders. Then from here, we're going to push up and then get up as far as we can here. And then the head goes back. So come back down. Here we go. Push up. Breathe. Hold it. Back down. All right, we're going to do it again. This time we're going to count to ten. Here we go. Up. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Back down. Now we're going to do a thing called upper dog. So come back to the hands and knees position. Put the toes here with the ball of the foot down in the floor. Hands here. Now what we're going to do is get the knees off the floor and then we're going to tilt back, putting your uh, weight over top of your heels. So now you can feel that in your calves. Now from here you can walk it out. Walk it out here. Lift the foot up. Walk it out here. Head down. Breathe as you do this. Now you can do both here. Up. Down, up, down, good. Now from here, one leg out, up, down, switch, one leg out, up, down, good. Now take this leg, bring it up, come on up. So now we're in this position with the knee forward here, this leg here. In the karate we call this a bow stance. Now what you're going to do is get down as low as you can, fist out, hand out, and look over here. This is what you call a warrior stance. I want you to hold it here. We're going to hold it for a count of 10. Then we're going to switch over and go to this side, a count of 10. So from here, knee forward, toes all facing this way. This leg straight, this one forward. So hold the hands out. Here we go, count of 10. Breathe. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Switch over. Come back here. Switch. Keeping the arms up. Bend that knee. Here we go. Count to ten. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 
eight, nine, and ten. Now what we're going to do is go back and forth. That's one, and we're going to do ten in that. So from you can relax your arms for a moment. So that's what we're going to do here. Go one side, other side, and turn into there. So starting out, here we go. It's one, it's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Awesome. Now the next thing we're going to do is called a four-point squat. We take your legs out. We're going to do the standard squat. We're going to come down, but only halfway here. We're going to go down low. Next, come the middle and back. So four points. Instead of all the way going down, you go partial the way, go down, come back partial the way, all the way up. So let's go for uh, 15 of these. So there we go. Hands here. Go half, down, half, up, one. Half, down, half, up, two. Go in the middle, down, up, three. Here we go. Half, down, half, up, four. Half, down, half, up, five. Feeling the burn yet? Half, down, half, up, six. Half, down, half, up, seven. Half, down, half, up, eight. We're getting there. Half, down, half, up, nine. Half, down, half, up. There's ten. Almost there. Half, down, half, up. There's eleven. Half, down, half, up. There's twelve. Half, down, half, up. There's thirteen. Half, down, half, up. There's fourteen. Half, down, half, up. There's fifteen. Good job. You made it through that. All right. Next, what we're going to do is called the oblique crunch. So we're going to lay down. When you're doing your crunches, make sure your fingertips are like this in the back of your head, so you're going in here. And don't lift on your neck. You don't want to do that. And here's the crunch. We don't have to come all the way up. Here's a good idea with the crunch. Breathe in, breathe out, and lift that up. But this time with the oblique crunch, we come up and then we're going to twist with one side. So from here, come up and twist. Hold it there. So up, twist. So we're going to go for the count of 15 on the one side and 15 on the other side. We're not going to switch to one side to the other side. We're going to just go for 15 on one and then go to the other. Here we go. So from here, up, twist, one. Up, hold it, two. Here we go, breathe in. Up, breathe out. Three, breathe in. Up, four, breathe in. Up, this five, breathe in. Up, six, up, seven. Problem is a lot of people try to rush this. Up, eight, up, nine, up, ten, up, eleven, up, twelve, up, thirteen, almost there, here we go, up, fourteen, hold it, last one I want you to hold it there, up, and fifteen, hold it there, crunch and feel that crunch, come on back down, let's go to the other side, up, turn in one, breathe with it, up, exhale, two, here we go, breathe, up, three, here we go, breathe in, up, there's four, here we go, breathe in, up, five, hold it there, up, six, there you go, sit up, over, hold it, seven, up, hold it, eight, breathe in, up, exhale, nine, up, ten, almost there, here you go, up, eleven, breathe in, up, twelve, here we go, up, thirteen, here we go, breathe in, up, fourteen, and the last one, hold it there, 
Oh, hold it. 15. Good. All right. Awesome job on that. Okay, now the next thing we're going to do is we're going to reach out like this and sit up. We're going to go for 10 of these. So from here, hand behind the head, just one out like this. Breathe in, breathe out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Don't forget to breathe. Eight, nine, ten. Let's go to the other hand. Pick up there. Here we go. Breathe in. Exhale. One. Two, three, four, five, don't forget to breathe, six, seven, eight, nine, almost there, one more, ten, all right, good job, now we're going to do some push-ups, this is what I call the bulldog push-ups. And then we'll put our hands in like this. So we're going for 10 of these, and then uh, we can go from there. So hands like this. Again, like I said before, you can put your feet together for difficulty, or you can put them out like this. So you can put your feet out wide or have them together. Now you want your hands to be just past your shoulder, you know, your hands right underneath your shoulders. You don't want to be like this, just right here underneath the shoulders. So here we go 10, 1. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. See how I'm breathing on my way up? Eight, nine, one more. Here we go. Ten. All right, great job. Guess what? We're not done yet. We've got one more set of push ups here. I call them the seal push ups. We're going to put our hands out this way. So from here, our hands are going to go just past the shoulders. So we're going to go the same thing, feet in or feet out, all depending on the difficulty level you want to go to. Alright, here we go. Hands out, feet out, here we go. Ten, down, up, one, down, two, here we go, down, three, down, four, down, five, down, six, down, seven, down. Eight, down, nine, down, ten. Great job, you made it through this workout. Uh, stay tuned for more workouts, there's more to come. Thank you.